Welcome back guys. I'm really excited because I'm going to be sharing yet another collection video. You guys seem to enjoy them a lot. And today we're going to be focusing on shorts for pear-shaped women because we all know the struggle is hella real. If you've watched my denim collection, you already know. You already know. So as always, I'm going to share a little bit beforehand how I shop. You can go ahead and skip ahead if you just want to see the pair of shorts that I own. And I'm even going to be styling them in this video instead of just showing what they look like just to give you guys an idea of how I like to wear my shorts as well. So let's get into it. As you guys know, there are literally like three things I pay attention to when I shop. Let me hear you say it. That's right, you're not here. Okay, so the first one is the rise. I like to pay attention to how high up the waist comes, especially with my pants. The second thing is the length because that can make or break how you look, boo. And the third thing is the material because I like to be comfortable. Okay, I mean, I think we all do, but I know a lot of us sacrifice comfortability for cuteness and I'm here to say you don't have to, all right? You don't have to. In terms of rise, you guys know, high-waisted queen, makes my body look snatched, shows off that waist or helps define it a little bit more. So I'm a high-waist person, that just has always been. I don't think that's gonna change anytime soon. I might do a mid-rise, but honestly, high-waist for life. The other thing is the length. So if you guys have my thicker thighs, you already know. Chafing is real, okay? That is concern number one. For me, concern number two is I don't need the yams out here. I don't need people seeing my cheeks, okay? I like to keep it a little classy. like to save that for the house. So finding something that is the right length, not only for those two reasons, but again, because it can really help to accentuate your figure and even give it a more exaggerated pear shape if that's what you're looking for. For me, that means something around mid-thigh. That gives me just enough material between my thighs to keep them from chafing, enough material to keep my butt covered so I'm not giving people a peep show, and it really just helps for my figure as well. You'll also notice that I don't have a lot of fitted shorts, and the reason that really is is just because the ones that I found end up being really short. I don't, I'm not really into the bicycle shorts trend unless I'm about to work out, to be honest with you. Bless all you women who like that. Bless all you people who do the Bermuda shorts that are fitted. Fitted shorts and I just don't. We not right here, okay? We don't see eye to eye, so I just avoid them. Which isn't, again, if I could find a good pair that would stay over my butt cheeks and not, not show that to the world, I'd be on board, but so far, it doesn't exist. The last thing is the material. It is summer. Don't get me wrong, denim shorts are cute, but for me, I'm really into linens and cottons or a blend because I want stuff that's breathable. The whole point of shorts is it's hot out and you don't wanna be hot and denim is heavy. So if you are gonna do denim, look for lighter denim options and you'll be able to tell, like you can feel heavy denim versus light denim. So if you're gonna do shorts, I like to stick to more lighter denims if I'm gonna do a denim short, which honestly finding a pair of denim shorts has been impossible. The ones that I'm gonna show you are DIY. I made them myself from men's jeans and that we'll get into in a second. But honestly, you want stuff that's breathable. That is the point of shorts. So quit buying polyester and rayon and stuff that does not let the wind blow and grace your legs with some air, okay? Okay. So denim shorts. I'm just gonna go into this for really, really quick. I'll be really short, really brief, and then we'll get into it. It is so hard to find denim shorts for women with thick thighs that don't show your butt or just that aren't super fitted, right? Like. All we want is the same kind of loose shorts that the skinny girls get. Like we want to have that nice little fitted at the waist, loose everywhere else that all the girls with little hot dog legs could have. Why is that so hard? But I have a secret, ladies. Men's jeans. Didn't come up on this for like a while. So a lot of people say, oh, turn your girls' jeans into shorts. But the problem is for us, all of our jeans turn into skinny jeans because we have thighs. Men's jeans, though, don't do this. They are just straight-legged all the way through. So I have learned that if I want some good denim shorts, I go ahead and go to a thrift shop, Goodwill, Salvation Army. You can find a pair for like $7, line them up how you want to, cut them off, fray them, and you have yourself some cute, loose denim shorts. It's like, and why clothing companies can't seem to figure this out, I don't know. But seriously, I mean, it's the best thing I've ever done. And again, super inexpensive compared to the like $15, $20 shorts. Even I've seen like 100 pair dollar shorts that you're gonna find that are supposed to be for pear-shaped women. So again, if you're looking for unfitted denim shorts, DIY them bad boys, okay? 
And especially because their waist, their waistlines are even, I mean, it's awesome. And if it's a little bit too big, again, you can always go get your waistline taken in at your tailor and then you'll still have perfectly good fitting shorts. Like they'll be loose, they'll have coverage just how you want it. So that's what I suggest, honestly, if you're going to try and do denim shorts. So without further ado, I have talked your guys' ear off enough. Let's go ahead and get into my shorts collection and how I'll be wearing them this summer. These white shorts are from H&M. They are US women size 10, made in Turkey and are 100% cotton and have been on repeat all summer long. These gorgeous yellow shorts are from ALC. They are US women size 10, made in China and are 58% viscous and 42% acetate. These burgundy athletic shorts are from H&M, they are US women size 12, made in China and they are 100% polyester. These cute flared shorts are from ASOS, they are women's US size 8, they are 83% polyester and 37% cotton. These leopard print shorts are from Zara, they're US women's size medium, and they are 95% polyester and 5% elastane. I don't recommend them though because the hemline at the bottom has already come undone only after one time washing them. And these are my DIY men's jeans denim, they are Route 66 denim, which I have no idea what that brand is, and they are... 96% cotton and 4% spandex made in Mexico. And they are a men's size 15 16. Well guys, that's it. Hopefully you enjoyed my collection. As always, any brands you recommend, list them below. This is a forum I want everyone to share. I want us all to be helping each other out, find the good deals, looking good, being comfortable. And you can just comment to say hi too. As always, if you like the video, make sure you hit the thumbs up button. If you haven't subscribed, what are you doing? Follow your girl and I will see you next week. Bye guys.